Derek, ever since we met, I knew you were going to be a special person in my life. Romina, the saying goes, God works in mysterious ways. And as you know, I'm a firm believer in that. Who would have thought just eight years ago, we would both have signed up for the same college class with seats just three feet apart? I wasn't sure how at the time, but years later, when I found myself longing for a partner that was driven in life, that was funny, that was kind, I was brought right back to you. Funny how those things work. In just the right moment, unexpectedly, suddenly, you realize you're no longer solely thinking about yourself anymore. His thoughts, his dreams, his goals, they're now yours too. Our friendship started off slow, a hello here and a hello there. That was until I gained the courage to address you one day by name. Hello, Romina. <laughs> <laughs> and there it was, foolishly fumbling my words, trying to play it off as if the name Romina was set on purpose. Falling for you is like walking into a house and knowing that you're home. So no matter what life brings, I vow to hold you every night until my dying days. I vow to comfort you when you feel anger, fear, sadness. I vow to throw parties for the highs and give you strength through the lows. I vow to always love and support you because the good things in life are so much better with you by my side. Now, standing here eight years later, joined today by our friends, our family, but most importantly, my soulmate. Romina, you're nothing short of a miracle. Everything from your beautiful soul, your caring heart, and those gorgeous eyes I could get lost in for days. I want to conclude by settling an argument we've been bickering over for several years. You'll often say I love you, to which I'll respond, I love you more. Then we'll disagree, and we'll go back and forth. After today, I think I can finally explain to you what I mean when I say it. So Derek, when I say I love you more, I don't mean I love you more than you love me. I mean I love you more than the bad days ahead of us. I love you more than any fight we will ever have. I love you more than any amount of distance keeping us apart. And I love you more than any obstacle that would ever try to come between us. You truly do make me feel like the luckiest man alive. And that's why today, I vow to forever be the husband you deserve. To provide, to protect, to cherish, and to love.
Sorry, it's fine.